what is up you guys welcome back to another vlog i'm probably gonna up with a jacket and a sweater because honestly there's nowhere to put you guys on here i'm starting a new vlog it's me a weekend of life i'm talking very slowly because i'm in a hotel room if you saw my last vlog which we'll get into right now if you saw my last vlog my sister and i are staying in a hotel because um we didn't want to do our long commute we're staying by a hotel but work and it's so funny because like that vlog I was like, yeah, this hotel is so nice, but it is currently 6.30 a.m. and my laptop's there and the internet here is so horrible. I put my vlog to upload last night and it's currently 6.30 a.m. and it still says it has two hours to go. So Hilton Wi-Fi sucks. <laughs> Oh my gosh if you guys don't know i usually upload my videos on mondays at 7 a.m i just like that i don't know why it works for me but i literally put it on like i don't know i think it was like 11 p.m okay 11 p.m um i usually have done that before like if i upload like if i finish editing late i was just like up, start uploading and just leave my laptop open and usually when, by the time i wake up at home it's uploaded but <laughs> The Wi-Fi here is apparently extremely slow, so low-key freaking out. Um, obviously, it'll be up eventually, but I feel like I just don't like when it's out of my routine. We're gonna see what happens. I again, I literally put on my hotspot, so we're gonna see what happens. Yay! And also, I'm speaking softly because we're in a hotel. And there's people like in the next room, so I don't wanna like yell at 6:30 a.m. So also, I'm not a morning person. <laughs> is starting so great um but yeah i'm not a morning person so we're thriving here but today is again we're just starting off so different today today's a normal work day though so again thankfully we're close to work so we don't have to like rush usually we wake up at 5 a.m to beat traffic because california like we have traffic today is just leaving a normal work day my sister and i will go to disney after work today which will be fun again a different change of pace we usually don't do that but we're gonna do that today so we love starting new things we love starting this vlog we love doing new things it's gonna be a fun time so yes i need to finish getting ready because we need to leave in like at least 10 or 15 minutes and um yeah and obviously do a final check of the room so we don't leave everything behind so let's do this what a great time to start the vlog um yay let's go what is up you guys i'm outside in the noisiest part of everything apparently because there's construction happening there's wind yay this day is going great for me but honestly my video is still uploading because what was that internet at that hotel literally when i left i put it on my phone's hotspot and to be fair like phone's hotspot aren't meant for like uploading or streaming it's mostly for like casual like browsing on the internet like if you're just gonna like you know look at sites you know like it's not meant for like uploading a video and it's not even that long it's only like 19 minutes but oh well so i came to this hotel this is not the hotel i stayed at it's a completely different hotel but they have free wi-fi also like i signed up to like all the hotels like rewards programs so sometimes some hotels will give you like free wi-fi if you just have like an account so i'm sitting here outside it's actually really nice out so at least there's that but i'm gonna be here for at least like 15 20 minutes just hoping this video uploads like it's currently at 89 percent when i left this morning from the hotel it was like at 79 it's been a slow upload again with my hotspot because it's not meant for that but i feel it's like the whole sunk cost fallacy right now because it's kind of like if it was less than like 50 percent, i probably would have just been like screw it i'll upload it at home and post it tomorrow but like since it's so close to the end i was like i can just push through and upload this video so that's how i'm feeling right now again it's so close that it's so close it literally says 89 percent. we're so close to 100 but yes this video has been uploading from 11 p.m last night and it's 11 39 a.m right now if you've seen this vlog this week in a live go comment on last week's vlog and put a crying emoji because that's how i feel right now i'm just gonna wait here and see how much of it it can upload i'm pretty sure that like i'm probably gonna have to finish it up with my hotspot so that's why i'm just like hoping that like a good chunk of it just uploads now <laughs> it literally says it will be done in an hour and 30 minutes so oh my gosh like this has never happened to me if you guys ever are in orange county and need a hotel to stay the west end by south coast plaza has the best wi-fi <laughs> because 
last time I stayed there was actually during Chargers training camp and I uploaded a video and it uploaded in like an hour like that was like the fastest a video of mine has ever uploaded so yay I should just go there and upload my videos oh my gosh it just went to 90% let's go I'm gonna like legit cry I actually have like a good 20 minutes here okay guys we got this this whole Monday is just gonna be me figuring out my video woes like just upload like it's not even like the longest video like I said it's only like 19 minutes like I've had longer videos so love this for me we're doing great things but you know it's at least moving faster like the time is going down a lot faster than it was earlier so <sighs> this only means good things so that's my little update so far it is really nice out which i'm so glad the eclipse literally happened technically here in california where we're only gonna get partial eclipse so like i didn't come outside but it happened like literally like right before i went to lunch so i was like of course yay but other than that it's been a good time we're thriving here we just gotta make do with our circumstances you know it is what it is also i will say the laptop i use for editing is a laptop i've had since college so it's like more than 10 years old so honestly shout out to old school macbook pros you guys are legends because yeah this laptop has been with me i think since like sophomore or junior year of college and i graduated college in 2015 so it's been more than 10 years with this laptop and it's still pushing through so 10 out of 10 but yes the time is going down so much faster now yay i should have brought my food actually with me i'm so dumb i'm literally sitting at like this nice little table whatever but yes i'm just gonna enjoy this little weather just be out here for like a few more minutes and just my video will be up for sure at some point at least later on tonight i'm gonna go to disneyland so at least that will be a nice time for me also i'm filming with my phone so if i keep looking this way it's because i'm looking at like the actual screen instead of looking at the actual camera so how many thumbs up in this one clip can i have but yes good times good times we just go with the flow we make do with our circumstances if that's all you learn from this video is that you gotta go with the flow so yay It is super shaky because I'm using my phone, but we are done with our Disney day. We got the kitchen sink. I'm taking it home for my cat. It is now his bowl. He's gonna love it. But we had fun. We actually got on the train. We did a least Matty party. We did the little trolley DCA. We obviously ate a lab light lounge for the first time, actually. We've never eaten there before. So overall, a good afternoon here. Night, good times. 
we're going home yay but it's you guys i'm back sitting on the floor it's tuesday now also i don't know if this floor looks better i don't know i just wanted to try something different so i'm not always in the same spot but it's tuesday now i feel like this is when the blog gets kind of like back to normal because obviously today was just like a normal work day i'm going to the gym i actually finished eating dinner first and now i'm going to the gym so yeah it's gonna be very normal few days i think my routine has shifted obviously because yesterday was just a day and obviously we didn't get back home till like really late from disney i did order a dress from abercrombie and it, it did come yesterday i honestly was gonna do like a whole unboxing and everything but i'll just post a picture because again once i got home from disney i was like i'm tired and i need to put things away and like clean up and all that stuff so yay but like i said a bunch of times today's tuesday going back to normal i had a really stressful week last week so i didn't do my workouts like as like efficiently as i wanted to so i'm kind of dreading the gym today and for the rest of the week because it feels like i need to get back into like the routine of things and you know like when you don't go to the gym for a while and then you go again it just it's just more tiring so i'm dreading that but we're gonna go we need to push through so yes that is basically what's going on today i just wanted to give a little update so far for like the normal week but yes it's gonna be a normal week work gym and we'll just see what else happens because who knows at this point so yes that is my update so far we're just gonna see where the rest of this week goes yay welcome back it is now saturday i look tired it is what it is like i said it's now saturday it's actually 2 p.m i've had such a slow start to this day basically all my plans for this day continue to keep changing so even right now i have no idea what the plan is for the rest of the day it hasn't been a bad day though i think it's just more of like what the heck is going on i had to go run errands i had to return a package to free people because they sent me the wrong item and y'all i have no idea if i put it in the right bin um usually like I've returned stuff to like Abercrombie and Cotton On and they all use FedEx but free people use this USPS so like I had to like Google like which is the closest around me and the one around like the first one I found like I realized that they only had like those like bins that you like put things in and they had two bins that were strictly just for like flat mail like envelopes and they did have only one that like you can open so free people accidentally sent me a dress when I had bought a romper so I returned it but like it wasn't even that bulky but like it wouldn't like fit so like i like kind of had to like push it in so i'm hoping i send it to the right spot because other than that who knows thankfully i did get my refund back because i like contacted them directly and was like you guys sent me the wrong item so they did refund me but like i hope the package makes it back to them so that was that i did have an appointment with best buy however actually let me let me explain my camera I have a Canon G7X, I got it in 2018, it's a few years old now, okay? And to be fair, I also just like toss it anywhere. There was a time that my screen was actually already coming like unhinged and thankfully my brother had like the materials put a new screw in it and be back to normal. But it's been a while, like this camera has been through a lot. There is a speck of dust inside of the lens that I can't clean because it's obviously inside. Which is kind of weird because like for example right here in this frame, I'm, I'm using it right now, you can't tell. It's usually when it's like I'm filming outside at like the sky or something that you can see it. And usually it just kind of shows up like a lens flare. Like if you guys go into like my knots or Disney videos, it happens ever so often and again it doesn't look so bad because it's just a lens flare however last week's video last week's video is freaking cursed what there's some clips from knots where now you can see like a little squiggle line and i think it's probably like a tiny like little hair or something i'm hoping it's a little hair and not like a crack but it's a speck of dust and then that little line and i'm like are you kidding me and obviously if you watch it quickly you probably won't notice it but obviously i notice it because i'm looking at it and i'm like are you kidding me i see the freaking speck of dust in that little new line and i'm telling you guys that you might not see it because i first i try to contact canon i obviously has like their services to like clean stuff so like i try to take screenshots and i realized that like in the screenshots like they weren't as visible so it's about like a circle I'm like this is it but obviously me probably because i see it all the time i'm like oh, i see it but it's bothering me especially again with lens flares there's like clips that i can't use anymore because i'm like oh like it looks so like 
just this like you know you know what a let's bar is so i contacted canon and they were like it's gonna be like 400 bucks and i was like are you kidding me and then they're like oh no it's actually gonna be 500 because you have to ship it out but y'all the location have to ship it out to is newport beach that's literally so close so i was like can i just go drop it off and they're like no you have to ship it in so it went up because obviously they are charging me for them also having to return it to me which i was like are you kidding me so that's five hundred dollars so then i did an appointment at geek squad so i was like maybe they'll clean it and they called me this morning which thankfully they called me before i went because i did buy this on amazon and they're like hey you don't have a warranty with us so like when we ship it out to get repaired they're probably gonna ship it back because we don't have a warranty and i was like great thankfully the guy did give you a location nearby that i can go to that's like an actual camera place to like get it checked out so i'm gonna go there right now and just be like hey how much do you guys quote the cleaning because honestly if it's also like around 400 ish dollars i'm probably just gonna buy a new camera i have been looking at a sony camera and again if you guys have seen my quarterly resets I i've been wanting to get a new camera anyway it just wasn't in my plans yet which i think is what sucks so if they quote me also like an obnoxious number i might just get a new camera so we're gonna see what happens there so that's all that i have so far so i'm gonna do that then i'm gonna head back home and again i have no idea what the rest of the days hold if anything i might just go to a coffee shop and like work because again i mentioned in last week's video i do have a freelance like side job which i really literally love it's so fun but it's just a lot of work especially with the startup process like the startup process is always like you know once the like wheels get turning it's easy but like the startup process is a lot so I kind of want to go to a coffee shop and like work and just get that done. I'm also working on my nutrition certification and I'm four chapters away. So I at least want to get a good chunk of that done. Which if you guys are interested in that, I know Maria who is a YouTuber. You can guys can see her in my comments sometimes. Go check out her channel. I love her channel. It's just so calming. But she asked me about this. I think in my quarter we said I'm doing my nutrition certification through Precision Nutrition. Uh, and honestly, it's great. I will say their chapters are very long. They do break up their modules in like three. So like the first module is like a few chapters of just like the basics of like how they do like their coaching all that stuff the middle section which is the biggest is the science section it took me a while to get through the science but again this is so important because guys nutrition is science and nutrition is not a one-size-fits-all which again i actually have my wellness channel which i haven't uploaded in a while because again i want to finish my nutrition certification so i can i feel like i need to speak from like a professional standpoint but y'all this is why i have like i have a video on my wellness channel where i talk about like what i eat in a day videos nutrition is just not a one-size-fits-all for like people and i feel like there's a lot of people on the internet especially like the fitness industry is like a kind of very popular at the moment like you know fitness influencers and all that stuff but y'all it's just not a one-size-fits-all i don't know like <laughs> i feel like again i can go on and on about this because i have so many points in my head both speaking about nutrition like i've seen people on instagram who have lost a significant amount of weight and then start selling meal plans and i'm like you're literally not qualified to do that especially because it is illegal in some parts of the country and even the world precision nutrition has a group on facebook and there's people across the world that like are partaking in this program and they literally say like you have to check your local laws because it's illegal to give meal plans when you are not certified and technically even for me i wouldn't be able to give a meal plan only registered dietitians can do that so that's like a big thing i don't know like i can go on and on about this yeah nutrition is just not a one size fits all everyone needs different supplements for example i found out i have like an iron deficiency so like i'm gonna tailor my foods and like supplements to that and again that doesn't apply to like the next person so i can't be like this is what you should eat because again I'm eating this way for my body's needs. Anyways, back to what I was saying. Precision nutrition, the main chunk of it is obviously the science stuff. And then the current module I'm in are like last four four or five chapters is like the actual business side the types of clients you get how to deal with that and all that that stuff but the chapters are long it's like 40 to 60 pages depending on what it's covering so I just want to get through that too I just want to finish that as well so lots of stuff happening but yes that's kind of what's going on today again i have no idea how this day is gonna go it was supposed to rain today so i had plans today but they were again canceled because of the rain so i'm gonna do that tomorrow we just don't know we're going with the flow did i mention that i got down at the gym right now i don't know i got down at the gym right now i did my leg day so i'm done with my workout but yes that's what i'm gonna do i'm gonna go to this camera place and see what happens i'm like low-key nervous just because i want it i don't know we're gonna see what happens but i'm gonna do that and then head home get cleaned up and then depending 
honestly depending on whatever happens at home because i need to talk to my sister like we will have plans as well but then we might change them i don't know we're just going with the flow so that is how my saturday is going lovely and yes let's just continue this vlog and see where this goes yeah what is up you guys i'm making the floor the new spot but y'all i got it oh my gosh this is a sony zve 10 basically the guys at this place which was they were so nice they were kind of like yeah it's gonna cost you another like couple hundred to like get it clean so they were like just get a new one which again is what i was already thinking why am i gonna put a lot of money into this one when i can just get this so i'm so excited because again this is the one i've been wanting it is just the body and one lens i'm gonna unbox it with you guys he did print already the sd card and my little thing on it however the battery is dead so i need to charge that right now but i wanted to show you guys it is so pretty look at it it is so nice the thing about this one too is that it shoots in 4k which again amazing the g7x does not shoot 4k if you guys were planning on getting it i will say the g7x is a great starter camera if you want to vlog it's a great 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 option like don't get me wrong it's still a great camera but what i love about this one is that you can get more lenses which again is something that i love i have dslrs the mark ii 60d and obviously you can change the lenses with the g7x you cannot so it's nice to have like a camera where you can change the lenses this camera does open out to the side where the g7x opens up which i will say it's not my favorite thing but you know we shall survive but again it's just so pretty it says 4k and it's just so nice i do need to do the setup process in a bit i just need to charge the battery which i probably should have done as soon as i got home but i was like hanging out look i did put the strap on which i was like oh i'm just gonna let him it's fine i just love that i can have like the sound on you can connect the mic to this as well which again is something that i love again 4k is like amazing so i can start shooting 4k even for this vlog i might just finish it up with the g7x just because i don't want to switch the quality like i'll start my next videos fully with this and the 4k so it'll be more amazing quality but i'm so excited to use it guys it is so pretty it was so funny because he was like what are you using for i was like for blogging because he had shown me like a completely different camera that was more for like actually take pictures and i was like but i need it for blog so he's like okay here's this one and i was like oh, you know what i was already gonna get that one um, but other than that i'm so excited to use this so excited to finally have this and hopefully it just helps my content a lot more especially because again this freaking like little speck of dust not ideal thank you speck of dust for being in my lens and for canon being so expensive so yay i'm so excited to try this out and yeah i'm gonna put this to charge and then i have no idea how this day is gonna go so i need to clean up actually i look like a mess i wish i looked a lot better while i was talking about this camera so it is what it is i need to freshen up all of those things and then we're just gonna see where the rest of this day goes yay <laughs> I'm currently filming this on my phone so you guys can see the size difference obviously the g7x is a little smaller but it's not too bad something i did ask the guy because he was like so what do you want in a blogging camera and i was like i need something portable it's just like a slightly bit bigger but it's not too bad what is up guys it is time to wrap up the vlog i kind of got ready today i like curled my hair but you know it's just a tassel tassel little vibes but i'm just so happy it's sunday now i didn't go to bed until 1 a.m. because I finally finished my nutrition certification. I'm finally a nutrition coach. So that's something I need to start working on. But basically I had like four chapters left. And actually when I left the coffee shop, I think I already had two chapters left. And honestly, I was like, you know what? I could just push through. And I did, and I'm so happy to have that done. It only took me 11 months because why not? It didn't go at your own pace course, but you know, at least I'm done. So that is exciting. I'm so happy for that. But today is Sunday and I'm going to start wrapping up this vlog. I will include clips of the rest of the day after this, but for talking wise, this is it. It's been a very chaotic morning, I'm not going to lie, but my sister and I did see there was like some last minute reservations to Disney today. So we're like, oh my gosh, let's just go for like a little bit. We're just going to go for like an hour and a half basically just like a midday type of vibes just that and then i do have a date later lots going on today but that's basically it. it's gonna be a very chill sunday it's very cloudy outside which again annoying because this week literally says it's gonna be like extremely warm so whatever we're just gonna go with the whatever it is so yeah that's basically gonna be it for this vlog lots have happened in this vlog right like what is this vlog but i hope you guys enjoyed it don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't especially because the next videos i'm gonna start using the new camera so i'm so excited to see the quality 
see how it works all of that stuff so definitely stick around for that and if you guys have any questions let me know down below if you guys have questions about the camera if you have questions about disney if you guys just want to tell me how your week was i would love to hear it i want to chat with you guys let's make this a community you know and yes that is it for this video i hope you guys enjoyed it and i'll see you guys later bye